Hi everyone, I'm Amy and welcome back to my channel. Well, it's the new year and it's time to take down all the Christmas ornaments. Um, one of the things that we do that's a little different, I don't know if you do this, but we actually put our cards on our Christmas tree. So if you do something a little different, I'd love to hear it in the comments down below. Um, but we end up putting the cards on our tree so that we can look at them all the time. Um, it's that time anyways to take everything down, clean everything up, and begin this, the new year. So I hope that you'll join me as I take down my Christmas tree. I don't know where my handy dandy... <laughs> Sharp people need help. As you see here, I'm taking down the cards and I actually throw them out. Do you have any other crafts or ideas that I can use my beautiful Christmas cards? I would love it if you would put something down below to help me. I don't want to throw them out, but unfortunately I don't know what else to do with them. But I'd love to hear your crafty ideas. There always seems to be an ornament that's hiding. The funny thing about this tree is it's actually a pre-lit tree and unfortunately they all blew. So we had to buy additional lights to put on our pre-lit tree. <laughs> The joy of dealing with lights. So much fun. Half of these strands of lights were working and half of them were not. They were definitely driving me nuts. This tree folds right up. It's pretty easy and it just kind of needs to get squished to get packed into the bag real well.
Okay, now that the tree is out of the way, it's time to deal with these ornaments. Our cat cuddles, as you can see, her little eyeballs in the back, she's kind of like wondering what is going on here. Well, I'm actually just putting the extra delicate um, ornaments in a bag and then I'll later put those in a big plastic bin. I love this little box that these ornaments come in. As you can see, they have a little plastic liner so you can see exactly what ornaments go in where. It's a beautiful little box. Had them for years. No fancy labels, just a piece of paper taped on the box. It does the trick. As you can see here, I'm kind of taking a minute to talk to my husband to let him know I could use his help. This couch was a little heavier than I thought, but he was more than happy to give me a hand. We have furry friends that live in our home, so we put little um, couch covers to protect our couch and they really do the trick. I can wash them weekly and the couch stays nice and clean. And if you're looking for couch covers, I got these actually at Walmart. Well, it's all cleaned. It feels so much bigger and so much fresher now that the tree is out. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little video and we'll see you next time. Here's another video you might enjoy. And don't forget, hit that subscribe button so you'll always see the newest video.